Hi everyone, I uh, just want to do a review slash rundown of this new Klein Tool Scout Pro 3 data and coax tester. This, uh, this is a tool that I bought myself as a cheap alternative to some of the other testers out there. So don't do enough data cabling to justify uh, the more expensive ideal or fluke equivalent. Um, but I have to say that it doesn't disappoint and does everything that at least I need it to do. Um, main features for me are the cable testing, the cable length and also the mapping capability. Earlier on I knocked up this bit of Cat5 here with some RJ45 ends on it. Uh, if we just turn it on. So it automatically comes up with ID1 because I've got this end on it which will just plugs in the bottom here for storage. Um, and then if we hit this one here does a little test and there we go we've got a pass on there so both ends cabled up exactly the same way um, obviously it doesn't tell you if you've got it as an A or a B but if you know what you're doing you're going to have some sort of inkling as to whether or not you've got what you've got at each end and and you know you can tell that it's all it goes down to one end and back and it's all working fine uh, it also does obviously like I said the, the cable length on it so we just hit this button here I'm getting a read in there is seven meters so i measured this out roughly 6.8 meters so it's not a dead-on measurement but for the odd bit of fault finding and cable tracing you know it's, it's more than sufficient for what for what it does um the the mapping as well so you get these in the box so you've got five rj45 plugs and obviously you've got some coax ones there as well uh this is brilliant for you know trying to trace out those unmarked cables if someone's already made the ends off and not bothered marking it up for you uh, absolute lifesaver on that obviously you can get more of these ends um, but you know the, the five that it comes with for most jobs is more than sufficient if you're only using this on a small scale uh, overall so it's, it's a very well built piece of kit it um, fits nicely nicely in the hand it's uh, got some nice rubber grips on the side of it it's fairly robust, you know, it's protected on the on the corners. So it's gonna take a few knocks and a few clouts. This has got a nice little light up background there as well for those those dark cupboards that inevitably we find ourselves in. Um so yeah, only negative I would say, not so much for me, but I know some people would, would probably knock it for not coming with a case. Um I've just chucked it in a spare veto that I had with a some um, other client data tools and other bits and pieces um, so not it's not so much an issue for me but I know some people might might knock it for having no case with it um, but to summarize I think you know most installers this is this is going to be a nice little device which is going to help out on on a lot of your jobs uh, it's well built and for around a hundred or quid it's, it's definitely worth the money uh, it's got you know pretty much all the same features that some of the bigger players have got um, and nicely refined as well. It's big clear screen on it, well built. You can't really knock it to be honest. Uh, I hope this helps if you're in the market for a new tester and keep safe.